Dear Mother Earth, We, your human children, have given ourselves the name Homo sapiens. The precursors of our species began to appear only a few million years ago in the form of apes, such as Aurorin Tuginensis, who could stand, leaving their hands free to do many things. As they learned to use tools and communicate, their brains grew and developed, and over six million years they gradually evolved into Homo sapiens. As agriculture and societies emerged, we acquired new capacities unique to our species. We became self-aware and began to question our place in the cosmos. Yet we also developed traits in discord with our true nature. Because of our ignorance and suffering, we have acted with cruelty, meanness and violence. But we also have the ability with spiritual practice to be compassionate and helpful toward not only our own species, but other species, to become Buddhas, saints and bodhisattvas. All humans, without exception, have this potential to become awakened beings able to protect you, our mother, and preserve your beauty. Whether we are humans, animals, plants or minerals, each of us has the nature of awakening because we are all your offspring. And yet we humans are often proud of our mind consciousness. We are proud of our powerful telescopes and ability to observe distant galaxies but few of us realize that our consciousness is your own and that it is you who are deepening your understanding of the cosmos through us. Proud of our capacity to be aware of ourselves and the cosmos, we overlook the fact that our mind consciousness is limited by our habitual tendency to discriminate and conceptualize. We differentiate between birth and death, being and non-being, inside and outside, individual and collective. Nonetheless, there are humans who have looked deeply, cultivated their minds of awareness and overcome these habitual tendencies to attain the wisdom of non-discrimination. They have been able to touch the ultimate dimension within them and around them. They have been able to continue you on the path of evolution guiding others towards the insight of non-duality, transforming all separation, discrimination, fear, hatred and despair. Dear Mother, thanks to the precious gift of awareness, we can recognize our own presence and realize our true place in you and in the cosmos. We humans are no longer naive, in thinking ourselves the masters of the universe. We know that in terms of the universe we are tiny and insignificant, and yet our minds are capable of encompassing numberless worlds. We know now that our beautiful planet Earth is not the center of the universe, and yet we can still see that you are one of the universe's most wondrous manifestations. We have developed science and technology and discovered reality's true nature of no birth and no death, neither being nor non-being, neither increasing nor decreasing, neither the same nor different. We realize that the one contains the all, that the greatest is contained within the smallest, and that each particle of dust contains the whole cosmos. We are learning to love you and our Father more and to love one another in the light of this insight of interbeing. We know that this non-dualistic way of seeing things can help us to transcend all discrimination, all fear, jealousy, hatred and despair. Shakyamuni Buddha was a child of yours who attained full awakening at the foot of the Bodhi tree. After his long journey of seeking, he realized 
that the earth is our true and only home, and that heaven, the whole cosmos, and the ultimate dimension can be touched right here with you. It is our deep aspiration to continue his career of awakening, to cultivate our mind of love, and to touch the true nature of reality. Dear Mother, we promise to remain with you throughout countless lifetimes, offering you our talent, strength and health, so that many more bodhisattvas can continue to rise up from your soil. <laughs>